Hello. So, where are we now? Hello, everybody. We are in Walmart. Walmart so, some... we're doing some small shopping. So, we've actually chosen something to buy. We're already put in our trolley. Some to buy. Yeah. We will just like buy some grapes, some pineapple, some fruits, some worms, some healthy stuff just to leave. We don't need anything else. Yeah. <laughs> we initially decided not to uh, put on trolley, but finally we just grabbed it because it's too much stuff. By the way, I'm gonna introduce you to one of my best friends here, my roommate. Uh, he is, his name his name is Fuad, he's from Morocco and he teaches me Arabic as well. <laughs> yeah, Ahmed, he's a really good guy from Indonesia. Oh, thank you so much. He is like just a fantastic person over here in the United States. Oh, thank uh, he's you. a very successful person over here, I mean, trying to better himself I mean, on a daily basis. I mean, I so, learn al Arabia. Hopefully he keeps doing good over here. Inshallah. <laughs> 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 Ukana. مدرسا لي وسوف نتكلم العربية في بيتنا وإن شاء الله أرجو أن أكون متكلما باللغة العربية. <تصفيق> He speaks Arabic very well. <تصفيق> He's getting better. <تصفيق> okay. So this is what we've got. What should we What should we get again? Do you want to buy something else? I think I'm fine, that's it. Yeah. I got all I need. Okay. I wasn't expecting to get all this stuff, so... Uh, so, so much fresh stuff. The fact that we come here at 11 a.m., which is why there are not that many people, right? Mm -hmm. It's a late hour, shopping hour. So, you know what, uh, brother Fuad is an American, but he came from Morocco and he's been in America for six years. Six years. Do you want to tell something about how you could get into this point? Like, how did you come to America and uh, like, how did you become an American citizen? All right, so I have never thanked to come to this country. So I was doing my school over there. I never oh. mind or think one day to be here, but I'm here now. Awesome. Uh, so I just left my school over there. I was doing my second year in college. So I came here to the uh, DV lottery system for United States uh, on 2013. So I had spent here five years, then I become an American citizen. Wow, that's a huge and thing. Like, so how did you like America? Like, why did you actually America decide to be an American? America is the country of the opportunities, if you're not lazy. Cool, cool. <laughs> if you are a hard worker... I know, you are a hard working person. <laughs> if you are a hard worker, you're willing to do things, trying to educate yourself, you're going to be better in the United States. Otherwise, but if you're not, uh, you're just going to be waiting for, like... Well, it's another day, it's a new day, and you just, well, this is not an American dream. This is was just a lie, but you have to work hard, buddy. You have to make the dream yourself. I see, I see, you got you. Yeah. So, the point is working hard. So no, matter, no matter who you are, and in which point you are now, if you stop working hard and hard, inshallah, you will come to the land of opportunity. Yeah, definitely. If you are a hard worker, you're gonna reach your goal. You're gonna get it one day. Uh, specifically, if you are in school, please keep working hard. Don't give up. Once you get that degree, no one is gonna take it away from you. Please focus on school. If you are in school, don't give up. The job or the opportunity will come one day. It's all about education in this country. United States without education means nothing, buddy. You have to be educated in this country, so that way you can be doing something like 
that you like and that you want to do and in a really good career not just being in the United States as a member you gotta be here as something that you can give something to others that's all I have to say to my baby leave. let's do another one tomorrow okay. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta, you gotta keep going man you gotta, you gotta go I think that was special <laughs> It's good. Yeah. I think, I think from what you've said, it reflects how, how hard it, like how, how real your dream was, and right. also like how hard you were working on it. And um, you know, like I'm sure that the fact that you've been surviving here in America, and you, you told me before that you actually came here with nothing, like you just like started working hard and tried your best. I think this is yeah. one of your best achievements so far. You know what? He just got married actually with, a, with somebody from Morocco and and um, yeah, let's wish him the best. Okay? <laughs> um, you <Thanks> gotta, guys. <laughs> you gotta go home and I'll see you in the next video. Please subscribe this a thousand and thousands of times for this guy. <laughs> Please subscribe. <laughs>